क्वेश्चन नंबर इलेवन इज सिंपल क्वेश्चन ऑफ मेट्रेस इन विच मैट्रिक्स ए इज गिवन फाइव ए माइनस बी थ्री एंड टू उसके बाद एक इक्वेशन दी हुई है ए इन टू एडजॉइंट ए इक्वल्स ए इन टू ए ट्रांसफोज इसमें हमसे फाइव ए प्लस बी की वैल्यू पूछी जा रही है इसके लिए हम लोग क्या कर रहे हैं इस इक्वेशन को सिंप्लीफाई कर रहे हैं ए इन टू एडजॉइंट ए बाई द प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ मेट्रेस कैन वी रिटर्न एज डिटर्मिनेंट ऑफ ए इन टू आई वेर आई इज आइडेंटिटी मैट्रिक्स ऑफ ऑर्डर टू and here it is a into a transpose so matrix a is 5a minus b 3 2 a transpose we can obtain by interchanging the rows and columns of this matrix that is going to be 5a minus b 3 and 2 the left hand side can be easily calculated because determinant of a from here is 10a plus 3b Now left hand side is going to be matrix. Here it will be one zero zero one. So this is ten a plus three b. Then is zero. Then is zero. Ten a plus three b. And on the right hand side, if we multiply the two matrices, this is twenty five a square plus b square. Then is going to be fifteen a plus two b. This is fifteen a minus two b. Then is fifteen a minus two b. And this is then nine plus four, that is thirty. So now we can compare the two matrices, and from here you will get a relation ten a plus three b equals thirteen, and fifteen a minus two b equals zero. now if we will solve the two equations then we will get 5a as 2 and b as 3 and therefore 5a plus b equals 5 and hence the answer for this question is going to be 3 in question number 12 there is a function fx tan was root over of 1 plus sin x upon 1 minus sin x where x lies in this interval we have to write down the equation of normal at x equal to pi by 6 and from the option we have to find out which of the points satisfy that normal right now in this case first we are simplifying this function for that we can multiply and divide this expression by 1 plus sin x so fx will become tan inverse now in the numerator this is going to be 1 plus sin x ka whole square so we can say ki 1 plus sin x is since positive so this is going to be tan inverse 1 plus sin x now here it is 1 minus sin square x that is going to be root over of cos square x that is modulus of cos x but if we will look for the range of the x this is 0 se pi by 2 so mod cos x can be written as cos x now we are changing this ex expression uh, into half angles uh, by using half angle formula for example 1 plus sin x this can be written as cos x by 2 plus sin x by 2 whole square upon cos square x by 2 minus sin square x by 2 अब इसमें दिख रहा है कि cos x by 2 plus sin x by 2 का फैक्टर कैंसिल आउट हो जाएगा और उसके बाद cos x plus sin x by 2 और नीचे आएगा cos x minus sin x by 2 उसके बाद हम लोग ऊपर नीचे cos x by 2 से डिवाइड करके अगर इसको अलग अलग करके लिखेंगे तो दिस इज tan इनवर्स ऑफ 1 plus tan x by 2 अपॉन 1 minus tan x by 2 एंड बाय फॉर्मूला दिस इज tan pi by 4 plus x by 2 लेट इज सी द रेंज ऑफ x दिस इज 0 से pi by 2 So x by two is between zero to pi by four, and if we are adding pi by four, this is going to be pi by four to pi by two. Hence, this can be safely written as pi by four plus x by two. Now we can see if x is pi by six, the value of y equals pi by four plus pi by twelve. This is nothing but three pi by twelve. So this is going to be four pi by twelve. So this is pi by three. we can see the slope is half tangent and the slope of the normal will be minus 2 so the equation of normal is given by y minus pi by 
slope of the normal is minus 2 and then x minus pi by 6. From the options we can check the point 0 comma 2 pi by 3 satisfies this equation hence the answer for this question will be 0.2.